30 passengers were injured after a flight from Madrid to Uruguay was hit by strong turbulence and had to make an emergency landing in Brazil, Spanish airline Air Europa said. Our flight UX045 bound for Montevideo has been diverted to the natal airport in Brazil due to strong turbulence, Air Europa said in a post on X, the plane has landed normally and those who sustain different types of injuries are already being treated. The plane, which had 325 passengers on board, was hit by turbulence over the Atlantic when it had almost reached the Brazilian coast, according to an Air Europa spokesman. The plane landed normally and was met by a fleet of ambulances. Airport officials said some passengers needed medical attention and were taken to the nearest hospital. The patients had hit their heads during the turbulence and suffered injuries including skull fractures and facial cuts, according to health authorities. This is one of several turbulence-related incidents to make headlines in recent times due to the severity of the situation and the injuries received by passengers. One of them involved a Singapore Airlines Boeing 777 traveling from London Heathrow to Singapore Changi Airport on May 21, when severe turbulence caused serious injuries to many passengers, even claiming the life of one. The same month, a Turkish Airlines flight attendant was flung to the ceiling before falling hard on the floor, suffering from a broken backbone when an Airbus A321 flight from Istanbul to Izmir faced severe turbulence. In May again, a Qatar Airways Boeing 787-9 flight to Dublin was met by emergency services at the airport after turbulence injured six passengers and six crew members on the flight. In June, an Air New Zealand Airbus A320 on a domestic flight from New Zealand's capital, Wellington, to Queenstown was hit by turbulence about 15 minutes into the flight. The incident left two injured. More than a dozen whistleblowers have come forward against Boeing in recent years, and the number has grown substantially since a door plug blew off a 737 MAX plane in January just after takeoff, leaving a gaping hole in the side of the plane.